spoil anything. Damn it. Alright, All right, so there they go. go. It started on Race Channel and the delay will bring it for us. And they start on the start screen, right? They don't start randomly, random places. Yes. Yeah. That'll happen later. Okay. Alright. Gonna refresh the stream, so they should be kind of synced up. Antelope's going the any percent route. Chuck not bothering with any screen scrolls is gonna knock out as many uh, caves as he can. Antelope finds level 9 right away, so... Used to do uh, the easier versions of this these randomizer. I would go to level three and then go to the bottom left to check. Yeah, yeah. Because at the point we'd have the sword. Ah, Caleb's got the sword. Nice. So this is going to be a what what maybe what I would call an easy seed. Having the sword within the first minute is, <laughs> I mean, that's great because having to search and dodge enemies and possibly dying and you know the routes you, you can go all over having that sword early is really good surprised he so willingly killed an enemy yeah without uh waiting for the for the bomb and then he goes in, oh and then find the bracelet under the uh under the armos there you're gonna get a chance at a bomb drop because he didn't kill anything off of this uh blue octorok let's see if he gets it he does get it. Very does. nice. Yeah. So yeah, so, having the knowledge of the drop table, it's funny that the the newer player waits for the bomb and Cantaloupe decides to kill the the guy anyway. Pepe, um, I don't know if Cantaloupe cho found that did went to that potion shop. See, this is where the biggest uh, divergence happens is that uh, Chuck got bombs, was able to check the uh, two bomb spots near start. Let's see if he goes. Yeah, yeah it looks like he is going to do the other one. And so we have a huge divergence. Cantaloupe's going to miss a whole bunch of... Uh, uh, he has to come back to this spot, maybe, to check that bomb spot. That yeah, he, uh, yeah. Was, it looks like he was going to uh, dance with some Lionels to, um, to try to force a bomb, but then he got hit. So decides to check Ooh, the last Chuck cave in the corner. Yeah, Chuck found a level here. One. Looks like one to me. Yeah, without being able to go <laughs> left there. Yeah. And it's filled with Paul's voice. So that's going to be, this is, you know, we were talking about this earlier. If Cantaloupe comes to that point in the near the same situation Chuck is, is he going to try to kill all those Paul's voice? See, that that's the curse of the, of the yeah. skill, you know, is to uh, try to kill everything. Yeah. All right. So Chuck's going to the coast. I don't, he can't do all the coast. He can only do two of the three. So. Yeah. Ooh. Hopefully he gets a, uh, um, another bomb drop, bomb dropping group enemies, enemy set. I did not. Did you see where the take any road was? As in level one. I think. Uh, it looks like Chuck did get the power bracelet as well, so you can. Oh, nice! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, bracelet. Yeah, feel free to call me out. That's all. That's all good. Chuck is out of bomb, so he can't do this one bomb spot. Is he going to try? Ooh, he just Ooh, got, he just got beamed. Yeah. That's not the worst thing in the world, really. I mean, he can't do anything over there anyway. This is that he's going to go to level one and mm -hmm. do the same thing uh, Kennel just did. Uh, he's going for bombs. He's focusing on the blue ones, and those are the bomb droppers. Did he get one? He yeah, did. Yeah, he did. Wow. Very nice. Let's see if he goes back to the coast or not. So Kano had found a level, I believe, was in the uh, Lost Woods, or not the Lost Woods, the regular woods forest, yeah, two. and find some bombs Sounds on two. the ground. So. Yeah, it's two. Uh, Chuck takes. You got a down. helpful hint. Okay, so we got Minhanla. Level three, over in the Deadwoods. 
he knows that's got to be uh, candle blocked, or maybe yeah, candle blocked at this point because he's already taken the ones that weren't candle blocked. Yeah, there's that yeah. one that's under uh, under the bomb spot, but true. Um, but that's a pretty high, a low percentage chance that he would get that. The ch trying the screen scrolls here, getting uh, yeah. getting hit by those bold rocks and the bolder ones. For the overworld, it's not a huge deal. This time, if you fail it, like he's been doing, but it's if even then, it's lost a second or two. That's not what determines the race. Uh, going to, the block clip is more important. Any he, he's going to get hit twice. Dying is much worse in this case than missing the screen scroll. Sure. The cantaloupe gonna probably get check this uh, check the uh, ladder item and see what's here and see if he gets the heart of the candle. He's thinking yeah, about he it. He the grabs guy. the candle. Okay. So not gonna. Uh, I guess he hasn't seen a candle shop, so he's just gonna take the candle and see. That's another thing. You know, your um, your inexperienced players are probably gonna take that heart just for some safety. Although I, I do know that a bunch of them are taking candle just to get, you know, to have the candle. It's more coverage. Buying yeah. the candle, you know, costs money, obviously. So let's yeah, find which, out what's yeah. in this one that uh, Chuck has died twice. Well, oh, wow. Well. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Died. He gets some money. They both get money, and they both get different amounts of money with the same message, so. That's a really low 100 secret. Yeah, 58. 58. Oh, cantaloupe dies and loses a bomb trying to open that one uh, that one cave. So back to start he goes. To directions. <laughs> oh hey, Chuck got it. All right, look. Let's see what cantaloupe does. He's only going to have three hearts. Oh, if he 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 checks the one above start. Let's see if he checks it first. Ooh, he's going for. I uh, got a minus nine. Not a big deal. Let's see if he kills his poor's voice. This could be a kind of a major point. When Chuck uh, finds a candle, Chuck. candle shop, so he's definitely gonna pick the candle up here with, with enough money. I'm, I'm very curious to see what Cantaloupe does here, and he leaves. Oh, oh he's he doesn't know what uh, dungeon he's in, so he just uh, checked to yeah. see if. It, uh, see what he does. Oh, well, he has a key, so he's probably just gonna try to go north and. Oh, don't know if he's gonna fight all these guys. There is a drop in yeah. here, though. Yeah, there is a drop. I mean, I... I, I guess it, it could be one of, what, two... two levels? Three levels. I guess it could be level seven. Uh, no, I, I think you can't go... This is farther right on the map. Oh, on the map. Oh, good call. Yeah. Good call. Th then... And I don't... Th I think this is the spot for one. I think eight is one further right where you can go up. And this, yeah, this, oh, okay, nice Okay, so he clock. ended up okay. <laughs> yeah, he got the, uh... Fuck. Yeah. Yeah, so he's gonna be taking care of those. And they'll come back if he does up A, though. So he's gonna go, just go right. Ooh. And he grabs the ladder Ooh. in level one. So he is rewarded for his persistence there. Uh... So that's really huge. It's, this could be a problem, especially if save the bow. So, yeah, Kamaloff has no idea what dungeon he's in. Yeah, he's just gonna... It looks like he's gonna bomb. Oh, Alright. He's, he's trying to conserve there's... his key. Yeah. But there's, yeah. He... See, this is this is why Cantaloupe got kind of seated lower, because he doesn't have the experience with uh, entering, not knowing the dungeons when he gets into them. Yeah. Chuck finds a lot as well. This looks like six or seven. He was in the, uh... He was... North of the Hundred Secret. Oh, nice. Nice level one there for Cantaloupe. You say the ball wasn't there, so you have to kill those bulls. Yeah, you have to... Man, did I call that or what? Um... So he ha... So you're gonna have to kill those pulls voice, which is... going to be, uh... problematic. <laughs> and... <laughs> 
slightly difference in uh, quality of item there for yeah. the truck. So the problem with six is that it's very easy to get ladder blocked. There right, we have our first Triforce. Is level one goes to Cantaloupe, so that's. But wow, I mean that not the Triforce was really the uh, the undercard of what he found in there. Yeah. Getting the ladder and the bow. I mean, two items you basically need. Bow, absolutely, and yep. ladder most of the time. Yeah, ladder's just nice to have for movement in rooms and and just kind of well, peace of mind going into uh, into levels. Any other dungeon, yeah. yeah. All right, so you gotta buy meat. He's not gonna buy meat. That's interesting. It's likely that it's not required, but you know, in the five percent of seeds it is, it can be very annoying to find meat shop if you don't have it set sure. up. Yeah. Finally, gets a second heart or first heart. Little insurance. Still feels. I think low. Chuck. He went this way, I think, and forgot to check that, and he had the power bracelet. Yeah, Chuck is winning with the the map coverage here. Uh, Cantaloupe's going to catch up pretty quick, uh, but he's probably saving his money maybe for arrows. He has the bow. Yeah. Oh man, the dreaded exclamation point door repair. Yeah, it's taking a lot of their money, and especially when money's at a premium. Kind of bombs and not the arrows. It's interesting. Yeah, the thirty. The 30 bombs. I guess he, well, he wants to do this bottom coast. I think. Or he's looking for... Uh, looking for bomb dropping enemies. And Chuck knocks out the north... Northeast side. Probably gonna do Candle check Cove out what, next. Did we know what the... Uh, did he ever check out the coast item? I don't think so. I think he... Uh, he just dropped or came out of the, the cave and then didn't go up. See, for my preference, I'd like to knock out areas all in one because I can easily forget them otherwise. So, you know, get the coast out in one, get the, uh, um, you know, what I call candle row, get the top right done. Yeah. That kind of yeah. thing. Finds the light sword, tries to grab it, it's not there. <laughs> So what's your do you what is your strategy for like keeping track of things? Do you are you a do you use your chat or do you have like a map I or use, something? I remember try to remember things. Like the only thing I keep track of is where dungeons were. Mm-hmm. That's it. And maybe the the oh and the uh, white sword item. That's which is I guess is a detriment. I don't use a map or anything like that. Right. If I have to as I you know, by the area for me, like Deadwoods or Candle Row or Top Right or Spectacle Rock, Death Mount, you know, mm -hmm. and then something off of that, like where the White Sword is, it's uh, right of the, for me, it's Top Right, uh, one right of Candle. I think, <laughs> I think uh, the kind of the evolution of keeping track of where, where things were was pretty interesting. Um, because I used to use, five. yeah, I think it was, what, five? Looks like five to me. Yeah, yeah. not really sure. Okay. I'm going to mark it five. But uh, it's funny, I used I used to use post-it notes to keep track of everything, and I had an, a name for every room. It was, or it was like, northeast of Heart Rock or, um, or something like that. I didn't really have names for every specific room, but I at least knew, like, the key rooms that were near it. So, and then, you know, once people came out with something like Z-Helper, uh, we made the laminated maps. Like, it became easier to keep track of stuff, but still, still finding, uh, um, still finding ways to forget things. Would you go for, find, he found the item in tri, uh, the Triforce in 5 quickly, now he's going for the item. Would you do that? Would you be going for the item? With? Hmm. 5. Yeah, five. I mean, five's kind of big. If he finds a stairwell here, hopefully he gets lucky. But I'd probably leave five. 
Um, I would say 90% of the time, the first staircase you find in five is going to be these because they, they don't, because there's this bottleneck and there aren't that many mm -hmm. doors. I mean, he finally, he, he found the item. Yeah. Or, but, I mean, he ends up with a boomerang, he's not going to be terribly happy. <laughs> I guess just knocking something off of his plate, you know, just getting, it's a, after he finds it, gets this item, uh, hopefully without dying, he'll be able to, uh, He'll just be able to forget about level five, you know. That's the benefit. Yeah. For me, I forget where anything was if I got the item and uh, hang out of it. Oh, he finds a recorder in five. Somewhat useful. Yeah, useful for getting around too early, I guess. Uh, he has to come back to dungeons for items. He's gotten all the items he can so far. But yeah. It paid off for him, but yeah. you know it's it's really up to the runner to to go for it or not. Problem Chuck has is that we know that we're the last. Oh, wow. oh, so power bracelet's required. Power bracelet wow. is required, and um, seven. It's right or next four. to it's four. right next to five, and Antelope didn't go check that, so yeah. He may hopefully he doesn't forget about that because. That's an easy one to forget. I, I, at Perfect. least for me, that, that power bracelet spot and this cave spot. They're just kind of hard to get to. Yeah. Chuck making the interesting decision. He found out that it's four that he found. Okay. Um, and he made the, it's a wizard robe dungeon, and he made the quick decision not to go in it. Left and uh, come back later. The problem he has is that we know the ladder is in one. And he doesn't know that, so he's not going to come back there for a while. He's going to clear everything else first. Yeah. That could end up causing a bit of trouble. Because he's going to be blocked everywhere, I think. And Kendall finds it. And he's going to pick oh, it up. he's, he's going to pick the book up. Why is oh, the book he was, not? He, he's oh. trolling Lizzie. <laughs> I think he's trolling Lizzie right there. Oh man. Ask him about that. Not making any friends here in the chat. He's but, not. But good for a laugh, I guess. And the chat sees it. <laughs> Goes crazy. Oh man. And neither player going to Death Mountain yet, but uh, just a ton of levels here in the bottom right. It seems that's becoming a very popular thing to do is save Death Mountain for last. Mm -hmm. For a reason. Well, yeah, I mean, you need a lot of bombs before you head up there. Um, yeah. Like, as soon as I have enough bombs, I'm usually going there. That's the thing for me. You know, something interesting you know, something that Cantaloupe didn't, didn't do was check where the roads went when he got the... Um, I don't do it so much anymore. Really? Because... You know, especially if, if I'm on, like I said, if I'm on Candle Row, I want to clear that first. And usually the next uh, cave is in the next screen, and I just mm -hmm. want to keep going on that. So it depends on where I'm at. Yeah. I'll, my strategy with that is I'll, um, I'll open them all and then cycle back to where I was so I don't forget. Do, yeah. Like do the rest of those caves, and I get the, I'll mark it on my map where uh, where those um, where those stairs are. Now up in four. Oh, he got the wand. Yeah, in danger mode here. These gels. Hopefully they don't they don't knock him out. I'd probably stand on that ladder. Good bomb by Chuck there. And yeah, they, I saw that. And then a mediocre bomb, but still uh, dropping the bombs here on these guys to, to grab the recorder. He's going to be happy with his, his effort. And the Triforce, he should have. In four? No, in five. Chuck. Oh, he grabbed it already? So, he doesn't know where it is. And it was right. Oh, it was that one room that he missed. Uh, oh no. Wow. 
Yeah, see, this is where experience pays off. I mean, you wouldn't you would know not to bomb the right side there. Now, got Dig Dogger in an island room. He would he would be able to kill them. He's thinking yeah. about it. Uh... Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The problem is he doesn't have any more, and he's one hit away from death. Yeah. So that's oh, there, oh yeah. There it is. They both die at the same time. Double KO. Yeah. Antelope died in a tough spot too, and four being uh, or not four. four I'm sorry. Where is he? Seven? Six, I think. No, oh, that's he's not in six. six. He's in six. Somebody was in six. Yeah, it looks like looks like six. But I think he was pretty deep into six, so that's a tough uh, tough death that far along. Yeah, six is another level where I'm just trying to get the Triforce and hopefully I find the item. Six? six? Oh, it looks like six. Yeah. On the okay, where is where his spot is on the map? It doesn't look like six. Maybe not. Uh, it's just just uh, weird, yeah. I guess. Oh, I think it's because if you're. Yeah, yeah. I think it's just like the way his stream is. There's a little more room at the top. Okay. I'm gonna fix that. Yeah, his stream. Not uh, your, not the restream. I'm just looking at your stream. So, uh, Chuck did a. Uh, he remembered where the white sword was. That was got very, it. Yeah, very smart. Grabbing the white sword and gets the screen screen. So. Yeah. He hasn't completed a dungeon yet, and he's been in a lot of them. That's yeah. a feeling I hate. Yeah, oh god. It happens more in Second Quest. That's a good move he made there to get into the doorway. Is he gonna try? Is he gonna try? He <laughs> is! <laughs> he, was, he was punished. Ouch. Yeah. Ouch! Uh, he had a lot of money, so he figured, why not try to get richer? It, it uh, didn't pay off there. Blue ring. Yeah. About, cause especially since the uh, 50 secret was bad, or 100 secret was bad. <laughs> 50 secret. <laughs> Multi pass. He's gonna take a road. He is. All right, so he is doing my strat. Wonder if he knows how the stairs work. A straight. Nice. He knows it way better than me. I'll tell you that, cause yeah. I always mess that up. Yeah, well, he doesn't have any bombs, but he, there are a couple open spots here. There's this. Um, I think he's marking. Yeah, he's marking right now. Uh, where the take any roads were. Uh, good. Find, find some blue gorillas. So, or blue moblins. There's that blue ring he probably, is, he probably wants. I wonder what color Link will be after blue it, ring. It, it, it goes to blue. Oh, it does. Oh, it, it does. Yeah, yeah. The uh, non-modified link is affected. He goes to the grave or not after this, or goes back to the take any road. Yeah, I hate coming back over here. I'm gonna. Yeah, we can get the power bracelet too. He doesn't have any bombs, so he's gonna miss that medicine cave. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, yeah, he gotta buy those. He oh, doesn't know. He's thinking, he's sure. Thinking. He Does might he, buy both. He yeah. has enough. I would buy both just just for the fact that you can't up A out of the uh, tax man. Yeah, he doesn't. He buys bait. Antelope with no bombs either finds a group of moblins, and they do not oblige. Is a hand. Oh. Bomb, so he doesn't know the white sword is to the right there, so that's that sucks for him. Yeah, really. Ooh, let's yeah, see if he survives. Let's see if he gets through this or not. Well, at least he knows not to check the uh, armos there. Yes. Ooh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Will he pause the game, yes or no? Oh, oh, he dodged it. Nice. Oh, my goodness. What a move. 
Mary Chuck loses more of his rupees. That's that's the Plus thing. Plus forty-two. Oh, God. <laughs> the game uh, is becoming rich. It's, yeah. It's a house night here. Yes. Okay, uh, Chuck's gonna go to last. He's gonna find three there. With candle. So good. Finish that dungeon. Yeah, I think uh, you find one, two, three. If you find one, two, or three, you gotta just finish it. He did find one, but it was blocked. This is three. He did find three. Yeah. Um, and uh, free bomb. And it looks like an easy dungeon, too, so he's definitely gonna get that Triforce. Yeah. So we know where seven of the dungeons are, still looking for seven and eight. And pretty much mo pretty much all of the right side of the map is uncovered. I think there are a couple uh, burn spots that are not, like level eight spot and skipped oh. a burn spot. I think. Just went that. I feel like he skipped a burn spot. Maybe I wasn't seeing it. Let's see. Riches of bombs for Chuck. Be fine on his keys now. Four is still oh, depends for nine. Yeah, what, nine could be kind at, of okay. At what point do you point start you worrying mean? about keys? You know, or thinking about keys? Are you always thinking about keys for, for oh. later in the game? One and three have a lot of them. You spend a lot in five. Right, he's gonna get. There's his first Triforce. Yeah, he's on the board. I mean, it's close in Triforces here, but, you know, Cantaloupe's got a big advantage having the bow and ladder, because it's just in the back of your mind. Where's the ladder? Where's the ladder? You have to go find more. You have to go through the process. Like, Chuck's going for the item here. Like, it's more likely, if Cantaloupe finds it soon, that he will not search for the item. Uh, three? Yeah. It looks like he's about to find it, too. Uh, so... Ooh. <laughs> I like that one. These are, these hints have really put, put made this it made it really fun. Just, each one makes me laugh. A lot of them make me shake my head. Doesn't color even... palette difference there. It looks like just some brightness on the screen. Didn't need to grab that compass as he already had the Triforce. We can see the uh, this would be a good barometer here for kind of speed through the dungeon. You got Cantaloupe, who's the more skilled player, and Chuck, who uh, has the white sword. So, I'm gonna grab the red candle. Not, he's not happy with that. I'm not sure no, why he's not no, leaving. No. Hang out. It's not like he's gonna save any. He's gonna kill these guys for rupees, maybe. I mean, you might be thinking about buying arrows. Yeah, I, I always think if you find an item and you can afford it, and you you just gotta buy it, you know. Unless keys, I mean, you could be going for keys, which is not a bad idea. And since it is an easy dungeon, benefit. I don't know. You're looking for the heart, maybe, or did he already grab that? Maybe uh, that's something I don't do. That a lot of people do is go searching for the heart. Yeah. That is true. All right, Candlewood picks up the Triforce. He's probably going to skip the item, but I don't Can't, know. I don't know. Three, it's hard to skip. I think you got to grab three. Let's see if he goes back in. He's going yeah, back he's in. going back in. Not the heart container. That's a good bomb. Yeah, that was great. Oh, he's got to go in this then last the room. Is He's going for the heart. That's interesting. Yeah. I think it's probably worth a key for him. He's probably going to want to find Magic Sword. Yeah. So, just any heart is a good heart. Even if it costs you a key. Cantaloupe, not, not doing it, because he knows that the item room can't be to the left there. But the red candle already paying off for Chuck. <laughs> as he misses. Uh, 
Uh, all right. Oh, I guess you can check the whistle spot while you're here. Yep. Yeah, go ahead and knock this out. Is he gonna get the late clip? He went for it. I'm proud of him. And he loses yeah. money because he because <laughs> he missed it. If he would have gotten the late clip, I'm that sure. would have yeah. been yeah. you know a level level eight with sure. Alright, Cantaloupe does Probably find the red candle, and he's not going to grab it, so... Level 3 is complete for both players. Completely complete. Well, a heart container for Cam, but he's not going to worry about that. Yeah. Wasn't worth a key to him. I don't... I don't think it is. Yeah. Interesting to see if he ever gets back to that area to get the white sword. Yeah. Depends on where 7 and 8 are. Surprised he's not going back to one here, Chuck. Yep, after getting to the ferry. Kind of like if the bow wasn't there and he finds it, he can kill those pulls voice fine, but he's gonna have to kill those pulls voice. And that's something I think he's trying to avoid doing. Yeah. And that's gonna cost time. That's the unfortunate of this particular seed for him. Yeah, you know, having the knowledge of the Paul's voice being in that one dungeon early, and then you have you know, maybe the bows in there in that level, and you have the money for the arrows. I'm all about buying the arrows. I'm going to keep bringing it up, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, first trip to Death Mountain. I guess second. He did go to the graveyard. Doing oh, the Spectacle Rock area first. I always forget which side that cave is on, left or right. I always end up bombing yeah. the, the right one. And yeah, that, the wrong one. that's why I always... Like, this one and then the one uh, where the white sword was in this one, it's the same kind of... You have two tiles. Mm -hmm. uh, I always do middle. Like, it's like a compulsive thing for me to just bomb in the middle. Because I'll get both of them. Yep, that is definitely the smart thing to do. No, it's like, it's... It's so I do it compulsively, even though I know now where they are. Chuck is is uh four way four four ray four ray into into Death Mountain, and uh, Cantaloupe's in a dungeon that I didn't see him enter. He's been here before. Oh, this is two. Okay, oh, it yeah, was that's two. Right, two. Two is, um, Two is north east armor. of eight. Okay. Found that one yet. If Chuck picks up the potion. Yeah. That's a common, you know, definitely, definitely a common uh, thing to grab in for anybody but me, really. Even, even like, uh, the five seed, Jay Coper, picks it up pretty often. I don't think they that was, that was uh, considered when he was seeded. <laughs> Probably should have been. If I were, yeah, if I was on the seating committee, I would have definitely docked him a few spots for that. Oh, okay, we oh, got hey, a man. seven or eight here. Looks like eight. Was up that uh, cave, that that doorway. Oh, thanks for. Oh, a nice uh, item, or a, at least a stairwell here. You always want to run into the stairwells as soon as possible. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so eight is a. It's a pretty tough dungeon. There's just a lot of. It's just a massive dungeon. There's a lot in the middle. You have to. Sometimes those outside rooms are key blocked, and you have There's... to decide one room for a key. I think Camp just picked up the magic key was on the floor. Okay, yeah, I did see that. So now key's not a problem for uh, Cantaloupe. The leaving to do it, just taking it. That's fine. I probably might have done the same there. There's a there's a very there's a limited but not insignificant amount of bomb doors. So you generally speaking use a lot of bombs in eight. Yeah, I mean you're checking a lot of walls that probably that probably won't open. So Pick them because there's you know if you want to do it efficiently, you don't want to go all the way up and around and that kind of thing. So it looks like, depending on if this door this room opens up he needs to uh, take that circuit okay he's good now and 
weird. Like a lot of the fireball statues don't actually drop. Like there's a standing, the standing, or they just don't give you anything. That's a great man handler kill there by Chuck. Yeah. They're getting bopped out of the out of the middle. A drop room. This is the uh, the tree room with the ten rupees. He's got some Normal. good skill. Like Chuck has good skill. I haven't. You know, I haven't really watched him play. I don't maybe watched him one time in the Zelda tournament or in the, the any percent tournament, but you know, he's he's shown some good good moves here. Like I mean right there, just flipping around to throw his sword beam at the other at the other guy. I mean that's you know it's not the hardest strat in the world, but it's just kinda of being aware in the room and aware of your health and... His fighting is pretty clean. For someone who doesn't, I mean, that's probably from the uh, any percent tournament. Okay, maybe that hint right there tells him that one is that, you know, close to start, and he did find the level that was right there, so. Hopefully he'll. Uh, head well, back. enough to. I think he knew that was one. Pretty sure he knew. He found that first, and I don't, he didn't have a key, right? Yeah. So yeah. That was the problem. Mm hmm. I'll go if we want to see. Is he stuck here? Does he have to go to the... No, he can go up here. All right. It's pretty... He's taking the strategy oh, of... Oh, ladder required as well with the uh, Triforce ladder blocked yep. in eight, so... He's taking the avoid using keys as much as possible, Strat, which is definitely a... one. Sure. Looks like he's going to take the staircase, I would bet. Probably should have just obeyed since he has three hearts, but... It's there. Doing this nice and... down... yeah. Well... <laughs> well... Dark. Some of these pallets are, you know, it's completely dark when you enter the room. Always a pain. He hasn't one of the settings to have all of the rooms like that. Yes. I never played that to... one. Yeah. I. That's about all I need to see of it. <laughs> <laughs> Which is nothing to black out. Yeah. yeah. I always grab the map in eight too. It's just a weirdly shaped. Yes, I, I tend to as well. Checking the map to see if you can bomb. You know. If He's been down. That, that's something I do all the time. Oh, yeah, definitely. At least we still have to bring up the pause menu with the uh, with the s select swap on. Yeah. Hey, let's see. Okay, all right. So now I'm just doing the... Uh... Oh, another double KO. Yeah. Oh, wow. So cantaloupes is... Oh, he... Ooh. Let's see if that's a dungeon. Okay, so it's not a big deal. Chuck could have missed that. Fine. Raft required run. It does have... It does seem to have that... Uh, like, we're... Well, we're still looking for seven. We found everything else. Yep, sevens. That's, that's it. The likelihood is low. But... Manhandler didn't go away, even though you killed him. Mm -hmm. It oh, well, it was a uh, Death Mountain. Um, I think top A two, I believe. Was no, it? Maybe okay. not that. I, I wasn't one hundred percent sure. I think it is. I think you're right, though. I don't think he's gone down to the uh, to the bottom left mm -hmm. spot. Yeah, I'll mark it and then change it if I need to. Cantaloupe skips the letter. The reason I don't get the potion is because of the, the text that could come up. <laughs> every, True, yes. Every time you are still yes. looking. That is very annoying. Yeah, and Chuck, man, gets a fairy and finds an item room, so he's got to be feeling a little better about how things are going. Kills all the enemies, then blocked clips. Standard procedure. Finds the blue meringue. Uh... Uses his last bomb. At least he found the there. other item. And then gets the other item. Silver arrows right here. 
Oh, right. what a call. That's big. Blue and eight. Everything blue and eight. Does need to come back for the Triforce, so... Yes. I think he's marking that. Yeah, yeah, I was right. A2, I was right. Good stuff. Kill this guy. Hopefully you get a bomb. Because you there is one more cave over there that you need a bomb for. Cantaloupe's only got one bomb and a number of caves left. And no bomb dropping enemies for Chuck, so he's gonna have to move on. Yeah. Back into let's see, what was you could try going back into eight, but oh hey, nice. No, Oh, there you go. There's one. Yeah, bad nice. death for Cantaloupe there. He had one bomb left, but we'd have to walk all the way back up to Death Mountain to find level 8, so... He's oh, going to need... He's going well, to he need. does have that uh, take any road nearby, it, so true, it's not a huge true. loss. He really needs to go back to one. He doesn't know this, 100%. Yeah, Chuck. Chuck does. But, so. Yeah, Chuck, yeah. But... Uh, Already been in there, maybe looking for bombs. Bomb chop, yeah. At a screen here. Uh, he marks where dungeons are, where potion shops are, but not shops. Yeah, not regular he shops. He just, just X yeah, he just X them out. So he knows there's something there. There he goes. Oh, so he's not going back. That's interesting. Let's see what he does here. He, he, I wonder if he for did he mark where level one was? I mean, he hasn't even gone back in the, the into there, even though he's more equipped four. now. I think he's going back to four first. Yeah, in the four, or at least getting the the uh, ferry. He's gonna get the ferry, and then since four is there, you probably just go there. That is my guess. Back into four. Um, I don't think he's gonna go left. <laughs> yeah, because there's a bunch of wizard robes. Problem with going into four here is that he doesn't have the ladder, and four is ladder blocked a lot. Yeah, just in general. So, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, because there's only one path to get through like, for a while. Five, yeah. six rooms, so. If any one of those has a river, horizontal river room, or a vertical river room, and well, there are two. There's the uh, cross. There's the t island. Oh, there's the tea room. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the tea room, the cross island, and then the, a, a horizontal. I don't think there's a vertical on this one. Okay, don't kill these. This is not a drop room. That, that, knowing the rooms and whether or not they can drop is quite important in randomizer. Absolutely. You can waste a ton of time. And this could be the item room. I don't remember if it is. I think it is, actually. It's two of these rooms. One of them is the item room. One of them is a open door room. Which, yeah. You know, Chuck did a great job there. Yeah, he knows how those wizards bay is. Yeah. So. Yep, and there's the wand. You gotta grab this if you're Chuck. Yeah. I mean, I, I would mean, grab it at this point. Just because you could get do four damage with select swap. It's a... I think it's a no-brainer. Yeah. Useful for Patra, and, you know, it's... You know. All right, so it's a matter of getting the Triforce now. Now, four is interesting. There are only two rooms in four. See, he's already using one. Yeah. Where, um... Item... Every enemy. The boss room and the empty room. Well, mm -hmm. there's just... There's no... Uh, yeah, no blocks or anything. Otherwise, it's nothing or, st or a standing item. Compass At least clear four out. out. If the try for if it's a T room, is it the T room? No, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, uh, that's awful. We've been calling everything on Chuck's stream here. <laughs> yeah. At least he'll grab some bombs. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully he gets one. Oh, no! <laughs> gets the fairies. <laughs> uh, Chuck having a rough time here in 4. Gonna have to use a key. Hopefully he can uh, walk around here. One room away. It's not the... Yeah. Okay, good. He's good. Alright, sweet. And he'll pick up the oh. heart. Well. Uh, a little bonus for not being able, if he doesn't get bopped by the blue goma. Alright, so he's at least he doesn't have to worry about four anymore, at all. Very nice. An eight now, he got bombs. The, uh, I don't know if he took it first or not, the, uh... But if he goes left here, I mean, he's in good path to get both items, so he'll be out of here quickly. Instead of having the ladder, get it, him getting the ladder very early is pretty much the difference in the uh, race right now. Yeah, otherwise, I mean, they're kind of discovering things at the same pace. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a taking Chuck longer because he's finding the items and he has to walk around and you know, that kind of thing. So it's kind of didn't have it. Let's hope he goes left there and gets the Triforce. Oh, uh, he, he's, uh, he better, he better use it here. Looks like he is heading that way. Bite the bullet and do it, which is good. I'll give him the uh, Triforce. That is a sight for sore eyes. I mean, and you had to use a key there yeah. to get it. So. Yep. Right. And once he figures out where one, you know, one, could be pretty, pretty close. I mean, I would say if he gets the Triforce, the ladder, and the bow in one, that this is pretty even. Yeah. I think a good decision on what he wants to do. Where one is, that could be the. No, oh, he's. Oh, he's got a question mark. On. He didn't know what dungeon it was. I'm looking at his stream right now. So he doesn't know what dungeon was. I don't know if he sees it either. Looked at his map and didn't. he's looking for L something, but ran into a question mark. So I, that's a problem, I think. And this forest area, so... Oh, he got bombs. That's good. Kind of got the items or not? He found the blue boomerang. Did he go? No, he hasn't found the other one yet, or he hasn't found the triforce in here either. So. Right, right, when he's he got some arrow. It's great. No. Right. Look, see what the uh, what the item is up here. All right, the regular boomerang is the coast item. Nice. So, okay, he's looking. He's, there's a tracker right now, trying to figure out what he has in. Okay, this is two. He finally found two. Very good. There are, so he'll, yeah, this is wizard territory, right? I know this is dark Knight territory. Definitely going to find the item. Yes. Find the ladder and all that, so he knows um, the uh, well, that ladder's in ladder, key, which is one. nice. One. Yeah. You'll find, find the magic key. Yeah. So what's left? I mean, has Cantaloupe done the Spectacle Rock area? No, we haven't gone up there. Yeah. Um, we don't know what's in that in the uh, cave. No, Chuck bombed south of level 9. No, he didn't. Nobody bombed south of level 9 in second quest. No. Oh, sec yeah, it's second quest, so it's so not that a... that could be something? At quest, this is first quest. Yeah, I know, so I'm saying the, the spot, so like, uh, B1. Well, B1, I see, yeah, yeah. no. But Cantaloupe's over there, so he'll probably do it when he gets out. Yeah. <laughs> Figures out it's right the spiral room. He has it right now. 
Oh, the two is that you just kind of you kind of just wrap around. Uh, two is a, a I like two. I enjoy doing two. Yeah, you really can't make a wrong decision. Yeah. The most annoying thing is two in two is finding the old man and having to listen to his texts or bombing yeah. to the old man or something. At the bottom of the moon, the left-hand door being keyed. Oh and yeah. Oh yeah. And having making to decide, a decision. Having to decide. <laughs> yeah. Always having to decide. Yeah. Antelope finds a, a bomb upgrade and has enough money, so that's gonna that's gonna really help a nine. I love having a yeah. bomb upgrade for nine. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, three, which isn't great, but... Chuck, you have to clear that uh, full, that scattered block room. You have to do it, because uh, you do get a drop one of the two times. You gotta do it. Oh, I'm still an eight. I'm surprised he hasn't find the, found the Triforce yet. He hasn't found the Silver Arrows, either. He didn't walk south when he found the blue, uh, blue boomerang. Good Gleok fight down with one heart. Ooh. All these keys that are completely unnecessary. Yeah. So exciting when you find them, but then you're like, ah, oh, I wasted all that time. We haven't found Magic Sword yet. I haven't found uh, seven. Uh, I think we're still one big secret. I think we've only found a couple of them. Okay. I can't grab level 8 Triforce. See if he goes back in. He does not. So he's going to be making a return trip eventually. Looking... no, well... The problem is, um, seven. I don't think seven's. Are, we have all the items accounted for except for seven, right? Uh, yeah, seven and nine. Yeah. Oh, what dungeon have you not gotten an item out of? Because where's the raft? Six. Raft has to be in six. I guess so. Uh, Chuck didn't find the any key yet. It must be in this one room that he hasn't. Oh, okay. Hasn't walked in. Uh, oh, there's, near start there's two either. rooms. It's near start. I would, at this point, just get the Triforce and re-enter. If, if I don't think he cleared this room either. But uh, So yeah, he's doing the smart thing here. Getting the Triforce and then he's going to come back in and uh, pick up the item. This is where Kant's skill is going to pay off in this, wizard, or in this magic breakfast room. You 100%. <laughs> and then he almost gets hit by a beam. Oh, gosh. There you go. Okay, he succeeded. Got a Triforce, <laughs> but does not pick up the ma uh, magic key. He's going back in. Back in. Yeah, that's. Oh, yeah, I think that's, that's right. a smart yeah. move. That was a smart, yeah. Interesting where the item is. Yep, in that one that one little room over there, key blocked, of course. So. But he does get the key. He's gonna walk well, back. I would up A out of here, even if it's only three rooms. I understand why Chuck's not. Yeah, it's for the health. Probably a smart decision for him. But I would up A. I. I probably would up A and then maybe half regret it because of the health. Yeah. Right. And the I'm only just... thing he hasn't checked. Oh, he hasn't checked this. Yeah, area. this spot. Yeah, that's what I was saying earlier. Antelope gonna <laughs> looks a lot like nine, you know, down to one, one or two hearts. <laughs> Dangling with these three blue wizard. Oh. Oh, he hasn't checked level yet. All right, wand for cantaloupe. Good job. Let's see if he get. He should get it. Right. Oh, he skipped it. Interesting. Good. 
Maybe with with no select swap. Somebody said he doesn't have select swap enabled. I don't know. I pick up the wand if I don't have magic sword. It just helps you so much in nine. Just Caleb didn't actually grab the book. He got near it and stabbed it. Went away. You entered the wrong seed. I did. I have done that, where I've loaded up the wrong seed and did a race. Yeah, that's happened to every one of us. Yep, definitely. Always double, triple check. Like he's gonna go for the item here. Um, the unfortunate thing is, is that we know 100% that it's the raft. Although raft may be required to find level seven. That's so. true. Yeah, those are two of the spots we haven't uncovered. But I don't think we've been the Spectacle Rock area either. I think we're down to maybe six, six caves that we don't know. Something like that. Five, six, seven, somewhere in there. Get oh I oh he's oh he could be missing the Triforce here. We'll see with Cantaloupe. He's killing the Goma. Skipping the Triforce. <laughs> Finds the other bomb upgrade. Good stab of the old man for good measure. No item in here. Gonna... Oh, that's where he came out. That's right. That's where yeah. he came out. Not gonna fill up on bombs either. No item in here. I think sometimes I get confused between levels, like which which rooms are item dropping rooms and which ones aren't. I'm pretty good on them to this point. Uh, he needs to bomb right here, Chuck. Uh, he's gonna b bombing left, which works too. But he needs to try bombing right because that there's two rooms there that he's missing. That's not a spot. Yeah, they bring up a good point in chat is that uh, level 7 cannot be on the uh, islands because the raft is in 7. Yeah, did they didn't get the item in 6. I think uh, it said Chuck had the, got, saw the book in 6. six. Or I uh, can't, I'm sorry. Oh no, okay. I don't know. Is that where the book... Somebody said level 6 is the book, but can't found the book and doesn't have the Triforce. But he got level 4 Triforce. He needs to answer the question, where is level 7? I thought 6 draft and then 7 has to have something else, but uh, I guess I'm wrong. Yeah, I don't I don't honestly remember. So. Just like any randomizer seed, forget which rooms, which uh, levels have the items. That's why I use my handy dandy Excel sheet. Did not get the item in six, and he's in there now. Yeah, having that magic key really just takes the pressure off for yeah for later. Because in nine, I mean, you have how many decisions yeah. do you make if you don't have the magic key? Uh, Where yeah, you, I never yeah. use keys unless I have to. Yeah, you either want. At least the magic key or one bomb upgrade. Yep. <laughs> Takes a look at his map and realizes he can't bomb down. isn't well he's one away from the magical because I don't think this one randomizes the hearts yeah I don't think so tournament flags do that I don't think they do but yeah. right or use uh, bomb right 
Because they use the key, but that's kind of immaterial at this point. Uh, the uh, Sword Heart Shuffle is on? Yeah. I think Sword Hearts is, is checked in this. Reasonable oh. chance. It's, uh, in 6, there are three of these rooms. Uh, two blue rooms. Yeah, I always forget that. I'm like, I've already done one of these and it wasn't the push block. Yeah, one of them is a staircase, the second one is a is nothing, I think, and the third one is a open door. Bomb where I told him he needed to bomb, so that's <laughs> that's a problem Chuck has right now. Yeah. He's not doing the uh, wand strat. Yeah. Yeah, that would have come in handy. Gliok, one of the most beneficial enemies to use the wand on with the sword. And uh, do we know what Cantaloupe's doing? He's probably looking for seven. He knows where six is. He's, he, he's unsure of what to do here. Yeah, I don't... I, I, he's using Z Helper. Uh, he told me he grabbed that. He does not have any bat open. He told me that as well. So he is all by himself here. Yeah. So the, Chuck. Uh, picking up the Triforce in six. Yeah. Really good. You gotta go back into one. He has to know this. Supposed to check. Death Definitely Mount. looking at the map. I, yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe he didn't. It was so early. Maybe he didn't mark it. I've you got it. Uh, he's got it marked because I've got a stream open and mm -hmm. he's got Z Helper on his stream and it's marked as level oh. question mark. I guess I could look at that. He first got there at the beginning. He wasn't sure what dungeon it was. Mm hmm. He's looking for his, I don't know what he's looking for. Oh, it looks like he's heading down there, so... Come on, Chuck. I mean, he is not that far behind. Oh, he's not there, though. I'm not sure where he's going. He's going up to Death Mountain, uh, Spectacle Rock area. Because he hasn't cleared that yet. Yeah, I mean, that could be the place that we need to go, because some found seven, so... The ring. If we don't know what he's doing. We don't care what he's doing. We don't care what Chuck's doing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, we got to talk uh, with him because he's taking his clubs too. We got to talk. Yeah, to him. Oh, I told him. Yeah. I told him. Yeah. I also found something else new. I'll talk to you off air. Oh, I've never been able to say that before. Off air, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about it off air. <laughs> hey, during commercial breaks. Oh, I could I could run commercials. I guess I won't. Though. Oh yeah, some people don't get them though. That's the problem. Well, there's a way. The stream up. I'm sure Jam would love that. Yeah. <laughs> this com uh, this commercial break or this stream brought to you by uh, the crisp, cool, refreshing taste. No, yeah. no, no. I'm not accepting that. Uh, what's it called? Woodchuck cider. Woodchuck cider. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so they're both having issues right now. Yeah, they're just, they're just, to... they're just lost without direction, really. Okay, he's gonna buy bombs. He knows the bomb shop's here, so he's gonna buy bombs. But what is Chuck gonna do here? Yeah, Kant's probably looking at Z Helper. It's like really lost. <laughs> I think eight. Finish up eight. No, no. I, okay, he's just gonna check Spectacle yeah. Rock. You're just looking for places to bomb. All right, so Cantaloupe right. made it back into six. Ant is doing something that's going to progress towards the goal of finishing. And so is uh, so is Chuck. So Chuck might find the last piece of information we need. 
Oh gosh. <laughs> no. Oh, we had man. a start. Oh, that clock. That's good. Yeah. We had a seed where it was these guys. Oh, there's there seven. There it is. All, All right. right. Nice. So now we know where everything's at. Where the starting location was the arrow pointing to the left. Yeah. Oh, gosh. <laughs> guys there. That was a pain to get around. Oh, uh, what was that if you cut out? The Lionels were oh. there? Yeah, the Lionels were there, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's... <laughs> so we know the rafts in here. We know that. Yeah, but um, Chuck, it, Chuck doesn't have the ladder in his block. Yeah. I guess he could go to the right if it opens, but it doesn't. But it doesn't. The level 7 is a wizard rub dungeon. That's always fun. Oh, yeah. Loads of fun. Oh, yeah, I could go up. We have not, we do not know where the magic sword is, so that is one other thing that we, we don't know. I guess it could be to the left, it could be on the raft islands. There's about four caves that we don't know. From actually, that chucks in. And Kevin found the compass, and it's nowhere near where he's at. <laughs> I wonder if he's, I wonder if he's going for the, I don't know, he said you said you already found the item. I'm kind of... All right, so he's up paying. Yeah. And yeah. Oh, it's ladder oh, block. Oh, okay. Well, I mean that—that's something you like to see, though, is the Triforce really early in seven. Yes. So now he realizes the ladder is not in seven. Uh, hopefully, I mean that's something that you can piece together. So. He's gonna get to. He'll know that the ladder's in the other spot. Yeah. Um, Did Chuck get the Triforce in eight? Because he found the ladder items. block. It's I think ladder it's ladder block. block. There we go. Yeah, okay. it's the same. It's the same room. It's that room. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you're correct. Hopefully, I am hoping this is the item. Nice reverse. Oh, that means oh. he could search all of seven and find it's the raft. Uh If he had done. If he had gotten that ladder early on in this, he still could win, too. He's dead. Oh, no, good move. Good yeah, choice. Running there. Into the wizard, that was yeah. really smart. Yeah, at this point, you got to get out of, out of seven, knowing that you haven't found or you haven't looked at, at one. Um, you know, uh, you got to take that chance of one being really small and generally easy. Uh, has the potion out and does not use it with one heart with those blue uh, land molas. That's that took some uh, took some guts. <laughs> and then just runs into the goma. Hopefully he hopefully he leaves seven here. Let's let's see. And hopefully save would have been one. okay. Good. If he would have saved there, that would have been perfect, because he could have just gone back. Mm -hmm. I mean, he knows where maybe all the dungeons are. Maybe. Yeah, maybe he'll check for Magical Sword. He's probably completely forgotten that that's where one was. Ocean Price is there. Oh man, so the magical sword is pretty much confirmed to be on a raft. Yep. Island. So what is he gonna do? Is he gonna go back into seven? I think he's gonna go back into seven, which No 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 okay. Okay. We will confirm though it. that he's forgotten <laughs> where one is if he goes into seven, gets the item, and then goes to the raft spots. There's that one spot in the top left where neither of these runners have, have uncovered. But, uh, someone said it was a secret. I don't think Camp did it. But that, that's obviously where he's going. Has forgotten. Oh, he still needs a Triforce and 8, so yeah. that's where he's, that's block. where he's going. His ladder blocked. Okay. Well, yeah. 
Yep. He's going. This is evened out a lot. Cantaloupe's still ahead because he's got the 1 and 8, but... Shot close to that blue ring, only... Yeah. 8 rupees away. Gonna go into 8 now? Remember that... Nope. Yeah. Yeah. No. He's probably gonna go back to 7. Because he's not up A. If he up a we know he's going back into 1. But I think he's gonna go back into 7. Cantaloupe found level 9! I think he never... he, no, he was the one that found it first, so Cantaloupe's looking for seven. He's, and I uh... don't think he... I, I don't know why he hasn't checked... He hasn't checked Spectacle Rock at all, I don't think. Cantaloupe did not find Silver Arrows in eight. No, he did so... not. Yeah, he's... he's. I'd almost say Chuck is ahead if he figures out he needs to go to one. But it looks like he's going to seven. I just think he forgot where it was. Yeah. Yeah, he still yeah. He still has an L question mark, so it's easy to overlook that. He wouldn't find the staircase. Uh yeah, a, a, so that Anything was everything else was behind that uh, ladder block, so we'd have to leave. Mm -hmm. Now he can go to the staircase and say, "Oh, hey, the item could, is obviously there when the ladder when it obviously is not." We know he's going to take it. I think. I think he's got one. Uh, no, I think he's got one other thing he can do. Or at least try. Yeah. That's right. Oh yeah, this is where he died. Yeah. So he can go I to this he... room. Empty room. He knows where the trife is. is there's not a huge reason to um, kill the Gliok. I mean, if you want, you know, the drop, the room drop, that's fine. Yeah, possibly but, the heart. Uh, that's true. The heart would be important as well. Yeah. One more. One more. It was a good Gleok. Up in this room. At least a good, good room here for him. No blue wizard robes to be seen. Yeah. Although he does blue wizard robes fine. I mean, there's no problem killing blue wizard robes. Oh, it looks like Kano's going to find seven. Uh -oh. He dies. Oh gosh, okay. He's pay up A here, grab a half heart. Doesn't not worth it not worth the time. What a pro. Any uh, So Chuck is gonna take these stairs because he figures right now that uh, the ladder has to be behind these stairs somewhere. It'd be best for him if he got blocked by something very quickly. Or he found the item, which we you know is the raft. Yeah, Cantaloupe is going to get the uh, Triforce here if he just walks the right way. Not far from him. Nice manhandle. That's a tough room to have manhandle. Yeah. Is he going to take the stairs? No, he's not. All right. That would have evened things out again had he taken those stairs. He still might end up taking them. Good for Chuck with the the item being deep. Don't die! Don't die! Use your potion, man! <laughs> uh, oh, that's too bad. That's why you have it. The sad music. Should I use a potion? Should I have, should I have used a potion? We're pretty sure. He had one. <laughs> yeah, it looked like it. Like, if he's in... Let's... Oh, um, yeah. He's switched here. Ring now.
the, the Triforce was in what, like the... I mean, it was close to start. Like two rooms north, two rooms right, something like that. Over in that general area. Oh, the Triforce was, I think it was just straight up. I think. Oh, well, Cantaloupe, I mean, he... Oh, he still needs silver arrows. See, that's that's something that, you know, he might he might say, well, there's two items in nine. I'm just going to go to nine. Yeah, that's, that's what we were talking about earlier. Yeah. Like, 66% chance of it being in nine. In nine. Sure. Uh, he found the item. He's not going to be happy. Oh, no, please don't die. Oh, oh the jukes. <laughs> please oh. kill something. Oh, good. He got wow. it. Nice. All right. Kant's got, the, Kant's got all the Triforces, but does not have the arrows. And we've got a raft. Please let Bay out of here. Uh, I'm not sure what his uh, plan is. I, did he? He had to have seen the, where the Triforce was. Yeah, he walked in there. And I'm not out. sure what. Uh, is still trying to move forward. The uh, Triforce again from the other side. Yeah, Chuck is nice probably kill. going to nice kill. Oh yeah, to grab the uh, item drop from the buyer. Okay, there's the Triforce. Okay. All right. Finally, we're out of out of seven. So now it's all up to him to find because because we're going to confirm here that he forgot what one is by whether or not he goes to one or goes to the raft spots. And here's Cantaloupe going into nine. So. At what point does he turn around and, and go after the silver oh, arrows yeah. after he finds both items? The... Uh, this is... I would still give the advantage, depending on where the items are in 9. Where, um, but right now, I would give... Oh, it's only it's not a big edge. It's just a slight edge to Cantaloupe right now. Because yeah. Chuck has two, three Triforces to get. If he only had 1 and 7 and 1, I'd give it to him. But he has to go into 8, and it was kind of deepen eight a little bit i think yeah so he's going to the raft spots he forgot where one is yep. which is that's the that's the biggest uh okay thank you in your favor and then the other one has to be the magical sword yeah all right can look at finding another stairwell not the item that he had hoped Ooh. Takes a Ooh. death. Yeah. Level 9 can be really yeah. tricky. I wonder if he's keeping track of it. Um, marking the rooms as he goes along. Marking the staircases. Because yeah. if he don't, I mean, it is it is a rough, rough dungeon when you don't know where things are. Fortunately, he's he doesn't have... He's not going to be stymied by locked doors or bombs. But... We uh... got a... We do have a 40% chance of being able to pick up the magic sword. 10 or 11. Look at your map now. Hey, nice. Oh, you got it. Right, That's going to help him. Yeah, it will. Yep. I figured he's going to look at his map now. Another he just clicked on it. He just clicked on it in his stream. On his new stream. He just clicked on it, so yep, now he knows. <laughs> Here we go. Now the race is on. And, uh, the Chuck, race is on. The race is much. Yeah. This is. Yeah. Don't be fooled by Cantaloupe being a nine. He lacks the silver arrows, and uh, and we. Chuck is about to, about to be really happy oh, here. Room oh, man. He skips it. <laughs> well, I think he's just like, well, I'm not gonna fight all these guys if I don't have to. So. Yeah, if he finds. In the, we'll find Bo in this dungeon, and he'll be able to kill the Poe's voice at that point, easily. So it's probably a good thing that he didn't kill, kill those enemies. Just go past them, find the bow, yeah. Or the other item, whatever it is. Oh, oh he's going to kill him now. Nice, with the wand, Ooh, too. Nice. Yeah. Very good. Yeah, because he's got, yeah, he's got, yeah. They go down so quick now, wow. He is going to be thrilled. Yes. Or upset that, why didn't I do that at the beginning? <laughs> Oh, that's what he just said. <laughs> Congratulations, Chuck. Yeah. That's that's a big big win for you there. A little more pep in Link's step uh, when yes. he has the ladder. Yes. And this is a, 
dungeon. Oh, Halo yeah. found the ladder, what, an hour and a half, an hour and ten minutes ago? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. And he still might, you know, and <laughs> that, that'd be something to be, to find, an, to find such an important item. That after much the further other guy. Ahead. Yeah, yeah. And that's, win. That's... Oh, what a All kill. Right. The magic sword right. paying off. And there's the bow. Chuck, right back into it. Yeah. Doesn't have arrows, though. Yes, he, he has silver arrows. He has silver... Silver arrows, so he has right... He has the silver arrows. So he is well equipped. And now just needs the last three triforces. Two tri three triforces. Uh, okay, good, good. Oh, he, he got it. The thing is, he knows where those two are, because he's been in both of those dungeons <laughs> and has seen them. Yeah, it's a lot easier than eight to get him. All it right, is. this... Uh, like, and this is this is gonna be fun. It's all, yeah, it, I don't I don't have sound streams up, so I don't know if they've heard where Ganon is. Uh, I guess that's the downside of not having the streams oh, audio. True. Is uh, I don't know if Kant knows where Zelda or Ganon are at this. Yeah, point. I, I would turn Kant's audio on, but it doesn't look like he's streaming audio. Looks like it's just video. Or I'm not getting any audio stream from him, so that's why I have Chuck's sound on. It looks like he's going to 8 first. Oh, this is exciting. I'm excited for yeah, this. Yeah, this, this, is... this has been a great, like... <sighs> it's been back and forth, like, who you yeah, thought was like... in the lead. Yeah. Uh, even though in Candlewood had the good items early, but didn't find much. Chuck was finding a lot, but didn't have the items, so he couldn't grab the Triforces. Yeah. And I'm not sure where Rick's going now. Blue Ring? He marked it. Marked ah, where Blue Ring he is, because he's got the he money. He did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, this is... <laughs> this is going to be real good. Finally, we get that plum link out of here. The, the fun <laughs> is, is that they're each of them made one specific mistake mm -hmm. that has cost a lot of time. Yeah, it's just gonna one. Cost, yeah. That's how randomizer can kill you. Just one mistake. Yep. Chuck with not forgetting where one was and not getting the ladder there, and can't not getting silver arrows one room away in eight. It doesn't. Okay. Get either one. Yeah, just go to one quickly. Yeah. <laughs> He's uh, come across Zelda or not. I don't have his uh, audio up. Or... Yeah, I don't oh, yeah, I'm not getting that. audio either. Yeah, audio right. I'm not, not getting there. audio. He's yeah, he's gonna... Man, he's gonna struggle through this. He's only got eight hearts. He doesn't have a ring. Yeah. No potion. Again, this is where Straight the up. I'm very skilled at this game. I'm gonna push through it. Yeah. Yeah. Not knowing the patterns, walking through the rooms, being able to walk through the iframes of the like likes. Oh man, walking across that river to get the Triforce. Such a good feeling. Oh. Uh. strategy in nine when you're searching for the arrows uh for me i take every single staircase because that eliminates the staircase on the other end as well absolutely because there because there are what uh 16 there's seven staircases and yeah. two items yeah i marked right? it up to h i believe so but the downside is that you you'll get scattered a lot because you're taking staircases that's mm -hmm. the downside to that be. Wow. Oh, he found Zelda. So. so All right. So that's that's middle. positive. Yeah, that's. A so good again, idea. even, even when. Oh man, it depends on how quick Kent would find the silver arrows in eight. I think right this second, I give the slight edge to Chuck. I mean, but Chuck knows where this Triforce is, and I think he's actually... Yeah. I think he's got a pretty good advantage here with having all the items, uh, knowing where 9 is, 
having the blue ring and having the magic sword and more hearts. All like, right, so this is yeah. yeah I, I think I think Chuck's got a pretty sizable sizable advantage here. I realized it was so easy to get the Triforce in hand. I thought it was harder. So yeah, I d definitely now... And he whistled the one, and now yeah. he knows where nine is. Uh, yeah. yeah. And it's not over by... You know, as soon as Kant finds either the Silver Arrow, which might have been a... Uh, might have been a uh, fake clue, unfortunately, or he finds both items, then... Uh, yeah. I so expected to uh, come through, especially with that start. Did I lose you? Can't figure it out where to. No, I'm here, I'm sorry. I can't oh, really? figure I out just... where to go. I was just I'm 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 watching the race too. It's hard to <laughs> it's hard to talk about it. It's just figuring out what they're what Kant's thinking, you know, he's probably gonna just clear the entire dungeon, and find these items. And be very disappointed. You know, I, I, I think, think once you go, you know, once you go into nine, you're not leaving until you have the yeah. information. Yeah. Which is really just gonna be gonna be bad. Right now, I'm really upset with how things are going. Like, really upset. If I'm Chuck, I'm wondering, how the hell have I not lost this match already? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, he he didn't have the ladder for an hour and 20 minutes. and, uh, and I'm new, expecting... Yeah. I think Chuck is like... He's looking at the race channels, like, constantly looking for, you know, the dot done to happen. Yep. Nothing quite like being in nine and having the race channel open with nobody finished yet. Yes. And, uh, maybe we, uh, well, uh, Cantaloupe could know where Ganon is. We, we don't know, uh, but he could know. Uh, so here with Chuck's stream audio, we'll be able to tell if, uh, if we hear Ganon or not. Another blackout room. Yeah. Oh man, get got hit by his uh, candle fire to avoid taking yeah. the four hits or four hearts. In the top right corner, not going to be a an opening there. Just get out. Oh, he is in the top. Yeah. Yeah. He, I think he had his map wrong. Oh, Ganon. Okay. But, yeah, here's Ganon. Yeah. This could be. This is imminence, because uh, Zelda's Found not either. too far away. So Z Ganon's to the left, and and Zelda is one room to the left and one room down from there, if he can bomb through here. And he can't, of course. <laughs> of course you find Ganon and can't go right to him. And unfortunately, I don't think I've found either level 9 item. Okay, well, here's Ganon. He's only, he better get his potion out. He does have the ring, so we won't be completely dr driven out. Oh, he's got it out, yes. Yeah. Being able to... Um... Oh, gosh, use it. <laughs> Being able to select... See, blue right ring came into effect right there. Yep, he would have died, and yep. that would have cost him he, a lot of he time. He would have died, yeah. yeah. Oh! Oh! Wow. No! wow. wow. All right, so let's just see which route he takes because Zelda's about two. I think she's two rooms away. I think she's down one and to the left. Uh, but so he's gonna bomb left, probably. I would bomb left here, you know, if yeah, I'm I playing, would and then I would yeah. go down. Oh, he's gonna take the stairs. Hmm. Oh, it's an item. Skips the heart. That's actually really lucky for him that that was an item and not a uh, and not a staircase, because it looked like he was gonna go that way. All right, he's getting he's getting colder, and now he decides to bomb left. I guess kind of being conservative with his bombs, but definitely should take these fire out to give him a chance. I'm taking a look at uh, Cantaloupe's stream here. He has not been where that uh, heart container item was. Okay. 
He's getting close like, to that too. He he hears Ganon there right there, um, so he knows where Ganon's at now because he was in that room to the to the left of him. And dies to the like like. Oh, <laughs> red ring and nine. Chuck is skipping it. Yeah. Wow, too, too and far away. Yeah, <laughs> I'm surprised Cantaloupe hasn't found either of those. So, Cantaloupe in level nine, about ten minutes early. Doesn't find the items. Chuck, Chuck beats Ganon and finds the items. He needs to bomb left here. Oh my gosh, and he does. Oh, and it doesn't take him, so he's probably going to have to take a staircase. The first red ring skip, I think, in randomizer history. And if he dies, he's gonna go back and get it. Well, although he's got the magical sword, he really shouldn't need to. Oh! Oh my <laughs> goodness. Oh man. Time for the beeline. Try to get left as possible. Does he realize that? But he already bombed yeah. her. See, I no, thought he Zelda was here. Okay, well, yeah. that would have sealed the deal, but. Yeah, I don't think he bombed yeah. left either. In this room. That was Ganon's room. Wow. Alright. One room closer. Well that's that's it. If if, if the he, door's if, in here. If the door's in here. I can't even see it. It, it is, I heard it. Oh. Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. What a finish. What a race. Race. Cannot believe what I just saw. Doing cantaloupe now. That was what? Just great job by Chuck. I mean, how discouraging it it should be to find all the dungeons and find seven and eight ladder blocked. Never find the bow. Forget. Forget where one is. Where the ladder was. Wow. Yeah, just, yeah. Congrats to him. Definitely not what I expected. That's perseverance right there. Yeah. Like, he, like, ever, you, if you know that, if, if you're making the assumption that he forgot where level one was, every decision he made wasn't that, was a good choice. I mean, and he played well. Like, uh, some, like the decision to run into the wizard rope instead of getting four beam, getting beam by, like, stuff like that. He did, extraordinarily well in decision making with the exception of forgetting where one was <laughs> yeah yeah yep yeah, yeah. and that's that one decision probably cost them 30 minutes or 20 minutes you know big big uh congrats to him though Yeah, let's get him, see if he wants to get in here and uh, give us what he thinks, what was going through his head. I mean, oh yeah, he's in. All right. I mean, it's hot here, but man. There he, there he is. There he is, yeah. Congratulations, Congratulations. Chuck. We're going to I think we're going to give you the floor. I just want to hear what you have to say. Oh gosh. Um well, I, I wish I'd gone back into level 1 a little earlier. That's probably the first thing that I, I'd have to say. There he is. Uh, there I, he I, is, I forgot yeah. it was there. Congratulations, Chuck. We're going to uh, I think we're going to give you the Okay. Okay, continue. I had your stream oh. audio so I was coming through. Oh, oh, um you're good. Because, uh, you know, level one obviously had a couple of key items that I would have liked to had a little <laughs> earlier. But, uh, you know. Um, yeah, I was I was really glad that I remembered where the Triforces were in seven and eight. So getting those at the end were, uh, were not too time consuming. Mm -hmm. uh, I felt like the overworld was, was a little rough. Uh, a lot of Lionel's patrolling, especially close to start. And uh, yeah, I had a really shaky start. I was, I was, I was, I was nervous, um, but a lot of, a lot of early deaths. Can you tell us your, what went through your head 
when you entered that last raft room and saw the magical sword and not a dungeon. Ah, that's when I'm... Oh, what, what was I thinking then? Where could I go next? Um, I think that's when I, I looked back at, at level one. It was, it was still a question mark on my on my map and thought, oh gosh, I never, I never went back to that. Yep. <laughs> and uh, I was pretty happy to be able to pick up that magical sword though. Uh, with only uh, eleven hearts, but yeah, that's when I saw the I saw the last dungeon that I hadn't returned to, and thought, "Oh, that must be it," and headed over that way as soon as I could. But yeah, that 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 felt like one of the more challenging ones that I've done lately. E either that, or I, I just did things in a, an unfortunate um, sequence. <laughs> That yeah, just made it harder on myself. Yeah, I think that was it, was that you had, had you found the ladder earlier, you know, you wouldn't have had to backtrack in 7. You may, you probably wouldn't have looked for the item in 7 because you had already, or like had you done mm, yeah, 1, you yeah. would have had the bow, you would have had silver arrows, and you would have had the ladder. So you would have cut out all that walking around in 7. Yeah, um, absolutely. Yeah, at this point, uh, your opponent, he got, he went to 8, and... Got the one item, but did not go south one and get the silver arrows. So he doesn't have oh, the silver no. arrows. Oh gosh. So we're yeah, we're watching this and you actually he went into nine about twenty six minutes ago, about one ten. And oh, you geez. you didn't have the ladder yet, and we're like Chuck's kind of in the lead here. Because he has the items and as soon as he realize when he realizes where level one is, he will be in the lead. Because the you knew where the two triforces were, you knew, uh -huh. um, you just knew you needed the ladder. So yeah, yeah, basically. That's uh, it. It was really neat to kind of watch the story of this race unfold. Yes. I and, bet so. Yeah, and like our like we're just watching it as fans, just saying like, well, man, what are they going to do next? You know, when will he realize uh -huh. where one is? Oh, can't skip the silver arrows. What is, you know. Uh, yeah, I was a lot, saying, of, a lot of drama. I think this is this is the first seed I've ever seen, where well, one versus one seed where someone got the ladder seventy minutes after the other player and still won. Wow, that's nuts. And he killed those poles. Voice got the ladder immediately. Yeah, I when I went in that room, I thought, oh, I don't want to deal with them, but. Yeah, or, or no, it wasn't that one. It was. Um, oh, was it yeah, I room? saw you go into four and immediately leave there. That was the biggest thing, that you you found so many dungeons but didn't complete any of them. That was yeah. the biggest. Yeah. Thing yeah. Yeah. Well, we saw early on. Either I didn't have a key. I think that might have been what kept me out of one the first time. Yeah. I went in immediate immediate locked door and had to had to double back. Um, Pulls voice and like nah, I'll come back later. Yep. Yeah, yeah. I think I was I was rocking base, uh, yeah, base gear at Thor that point. Three hearts. That's that's a hard room. I mean, yeah. at, that, at that point, you may not. Did you realize it was level one at that point, or did you think it could be level eight? Um, no. Or did I you even I, consider it? I hadn't made a connection yet. Okay. Yeah. yeah, based on like where the map or like where Link's dot is on the map, you can kind of tell which it, which uh, level it is. Yeah. I yeah, took. Yeah. I, I did incorrectly think five was seven for a while, and Ooh. then I went back and and fixed that after yeah. I realized, oh wait, this is this is shaped a little differently. Um, but yeah, it was it was definitely adrenaline rush through the whole thing. It was a lot of fun though. At, at what point were you checking IRC to see if Cantaloupe had finished? Oh, I, I it was it was open the whole time, so I I kept glancing at it. Yeah, <laughs> after. Yeah, after you know a minute twenty, I'm, or an hour twenty, I'm thinking, uh, you know, it's any minute now. Yeah, should be, but. And I, I had a really fortunate nine. I, I felt I didn't go. <laughs> in the whole left half of the map. Yeah, uh, yeah, Candle kind of hasn't right found. Into yeah, he hasn't found either item yet. So he's gambled on the silver arrows being in here, and they're not. I, oh yeah, I think you're the first uh, first person in randomizer history to pass up the red ring. <laughs> I th I thought about it. I thought, you know, every every second counts, and I think I don't I don't really need it 
at this point. So yeah. I, I, I thought, you know, I love I'd hate it. To, I'd, I'd hate to lose by five seconds and yeah. have it be, be because of that. <laughs> yeah, that buying the blue ring helped you too. Oh, like definitely. You stayed, like you got uh, Hyrule Driver to three hearts, which would have killed you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was a last minute decision. I thought, well, I, I'm at full rupees. I know where a blue ring shop is. Mm -hmm. You know, I keep dying. You know, I, I keep having just really rough rooms. So I thought, you know, it's worth the investment at this point. How many randomizer races have you have you done, Chuck? Um, just I, th I think this is my third one on SRL. But um, me and a, a, a few other friends, um, Oglib and the Dave, mm -hmm. um, we we do just do them on our own pretty regularly. Oh, cool. And uh, yeah, we we have a fun time with it. We just we get on Discord and just kind of run through it for fun. Sure. This. Uh... How much do you feel the any percent Zelda tournament helped you with this race today? Uh oh, definitely a lot. I mean, I learned learned tricks like the screen scrolling and uh, block clipping, definitely, and just uh, just better movement, how to how to deal with certain certain rooms of enemies, uh, and doing randomizers has certainly helped with with any percent running as well uh i felt some of your decision making on the rooms was like really good like uh yeah. like yeah. you were cut off in in the double moat room it was red wizard robes and you had oh, three yeah. and a half health left and you ran into the wizard robe oh rather yeah than that taking was, the beam that was intentional i was hoping yeah. somebody noticed that <laughs> i saw that it's like oh that's such a great move that's such a smart move that you did there i thought it was like Really good, and then you had a uh, the three wizard robe room, three blue wizard room. I think it was which dungeon was that? It was it was it was uh, there was a push block room, and you did that room so well. It's like you really knew how to fight wizard robes. There, that was such a clean room. To do. Oh, yeah, I, I I knew how to. How I should stay near the bottom of the of the screen. I, I in preparation for that any percent tournament, I, I did watch your very long tutorial. <laughs> it is, on, yes, on, on, on all the basics and I remembered I did learn that from that just to stay near the bottom and you're you're a little safer there so thank you that was that was <laughs> from you all right from the joys of victory to the stinging pain of defeat uh, let's welcome <laughs> in Kenalo our uh, 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 interview room here so, uh, Cantaloupe, uh, we're going to give the floor to you. We'll see if we regret this or not. Can you go through uh, the run for us? Uh, yes. Um, it started out pretty daggone good. I was stoked to find the sword. I was stoked to find level 9. I had a really good run. But um, I forgot to mark down where level 6 was. And I'm pretty sure you guys are probably wondering why I was just walking around aimlessly. I couldn't remember where <laughs> 6 was. <laughs> yeah. And, and then I found six, and then I was okay from there, but then I, I took a gamble on the Silver Arrows not being in seven and going for nine. Uh, since I quit, were they in nine? They were in eight. They were in eight. Really? Yeah, you were. So the, the one item you found in eight, uh, the Silver Arrows were one room south of that room. I and, thought I found both in eight. Holy crap, so I was just wasting my time. Ugh. It was it was tough. We were, we were uh, we were just like, man, he didn't find the second item in eight. He's gonna probably gamble for nine, and he did. Yeah. And then at yeah. that point, well, at that is it's pretty funny. Like the timeline of this race, you should go back and watch it. You probably will. But you were in nine before Chuck had the ladder. Wow. So Chuck forgot where level one was, or just didn't think to go back. I guess. Um, and had found all the Triforces, had found all the levels, had the Silver Arrows, but didn't have the bow or the ladder. So we were, you guys were both searching. When you're searching for six, I think he was looking for seven. Um, but you guys were just kind of wandering around, really not finding anything. And yeah. it's like, <laughs> really, what's the plan here? You know, at that point, we still, this was 50 minutes in and we didn't know what, what the outcome was gonna be. Usually you can get a sense, but with you ha not knowing where seven was, 
uh, and Chuck not having the ladder uh, was really kind of up in the air which person was in the lead. And so you went into nine, you took the gamble. We knew that that was really going to cost you and it was really going to come down to um, how fast you found the items. Yeah. And yeah, we knew, we, we knew what happened, but Chuck eventually realized it. And then within seven minutes of getting the ladder, he had both Triforces and was in nine. So, And then Ganon and Zelda was real close together, so, you know, because I found both them. Yeah, Yeah, we weren't sure if you had... Well, we weren't sure before Chuck got into nine if you had found Zelda because... Um, or found uh, Ganon because we couldn't hear your sound. Mm-hmm. Um, so we didn't know that. Uh, so we... We knew you had found Zelda. We were watching when you found Zelda. Mm-hmm. But, um, yeah, just, man, sometimes those decisions just go the wrong way, you know? Yeah, I, just, I thought I picked up both items in eight for some reason, but apparently I didn't. And, and uh, yeah, it was just one of those things, uh, you know, I'm not that experienced with Randomizer. I've been practicing all weekend. I had, had several good runs. And then when it comes crunch time, yeah, the... Yeah. What I think it's uh, what I hope doesn't happen happens. I spoiled my luck. <laughs> well, you're not out. You're not uh, out of the tournament at all. You know that. Uh, where do you? Let's see. I don't have the. Ra- you fall down. I, I've I got don't the think. bracket. Yeah. So okay, Chuck where goes does he fall to play. Down? Chuck goes on to play K-Mac. Uh, and Cantaloupe hmm. goes down to. Loser. Uh. Loser thirty. Things are always a tough one. So he plays the loser of the winner of Pierpont, Lumpkin, and the Seawolf. And the winner of them plays Putts. And then Anilo plays either Putts or one of the other two. Okay, so I got a little time to chill. Yeah. So. Yeah, it's just, I did all I could, man. It just. Yeah. I just. It's quite, uh, it was, it was quite the, uh, like as Lax said, it was. The story of this race was incredible to watch. Yeah, for sure. And comments on, you know, it was just like, we didn't know it was what some of you guys were doing at times, and then we didn't, you know. But, like, the decision make, we, we made some guesses on what you guys were doing or, or what you guys were thinking and what was on your mind. And then, you know, the decision making you made thinking of that is good. Like, you guys made good decisions. It's just you made you both made that one critical error that kind of described the entirety of the rest of your run, and it was just fascinating to see what happened with that afterward. Yeah, I mean, like the first half, it was just it was awesome. It really was. I mean, I was on the rolls like, yeah, it's gonna be a good hour seed, and then yeah, you forget where a level is, and it just. I mean, I had Z helper up, but I guess I forgot to click on six. So um, yeah. But that's it. Yeah. It happened so well. Yeah. Congratulations. I think you guys had one of the best, at least um, story wise, runs <laughs> of the uh, tournament so far. Yeah, definitely one of the best ones I've, I mean, ever that I've watched uh, just kind of unfold has been, re- it was really, really entertaining. So, <laughs> very cool. Yeah. Thanks for both of you coming in to. Uh, the discord and and hanging out with us for a little bit but we've got a race starting over in jam evilers uh stream so if you haven't head over there already you can head over but i'll leave it up Uh, chuck any final comments as the victor um no i'm i'm just uh really happy to get a win and uh and thanks for the thanks for the restream and, and the commentary absolutely cantaloupe yes oh any final comments um, I'm just going to quote what my file name said Darkling likes waffles I don't know why I said that but we'll just end with that <laughs> we, we actually discussed about five minutes on you know, well not five but I described my like of waffles so oh see that was just a random thing I didn't even know you liked waffles so I guess I like waffles <laughs> like Belgian waffles oh Belgian waffles nice yep regular waffles not the deep Belgian yeah <laughs> All right. Well, that's going to do it for us for Darkwing. I am Lack Attack. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Uh, that was.